Here's how you set up your magazine or news site uh, lickety split uh, with the issue M plugin. All you have to do is install the plugin, go to articles, and then go to issue M settings down here. Uh, there are two things you need to choose. One is where is your current issue going to live? So simply create a page and then choose that page for your current issue. Uh, the second thing you have to do is choose where your archives or your past issues are going to live. So create a page for that and then choose what that page is going to be. And what will happen when you go down and save this is it will output the default layout for your publication. Um, a couple things you probably want to do with the sidebar is add uh, a couple of widgets. Uh, one widget, and we're going to go into uh, widgets here, uh, is the cover image. And the cover image will display the current issue. And regardless of what article you're reading in the current issue, that cover image will always be there as a navigation uh, visual for the reader. So if I go to primary widgets here, we'll see that the um, issue M active issue it produces that cover widget. And you can see that it's already here. And the second thing is you probably want to list the articles for the, for the current issue in the sidebar as well. And that's the issue M article list widget. And you can see that that is here as well. If you have a lot of articles and you only want to show your article categories for each issue, we have a widget called article categories. And you can drag that one into the sidebar as well. So after doing that, uh, let's go take a look at the site itself. We'll see what the output looks like. What you're going to get, and this is the Issue M magazine theme, by the way, that we're working with, with which is free, and you can download it and use it, uh, is we have our feature rotators here. We have our feature thumbnails down here. And then the rest of the articles flow uh, down below here. And in the sidebar, we have the cover widget uh, here in the sidebar. And that produces your current issue cover. And then we have all the, the articles uh, list here. And then for the last widget is the article categories widget. Um, these are the your article categories for that current issue. Now, if you installed this plugin on your own theme or a different theme, the uh, layout's going to look similar but a little different. Uh, this is the WordPress 2011 theme, I believe. And the current issue looks like this. Your feature sliders here, your feature thumbnails are here, and your articles are here. And then here's your cover, and here's your article list uh, with the two sidebar widgets. And when you choose those pages under Setup, this gets automatically created. If you want to modify this, you can use short codes to display only the feature rotator, or perhaps you just want to display articles. You can use a short code to override the default setting. If you want just feature thumbnails and articles, you can use two short codes to produce that on the current issue page. And uh, if you need more help on that, go, go visit our short codes uh, tutorial. That's it. You're up and running.